Welcome on my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'd like to show you how to make a quite simple calculator using C language. Four options addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division. For example, I'll choose addition, type first number, enter, second number, enter, and this is the result. So, first of all, create C file and open in VS Code Editor. Include library. In this calculator will be used four operators. First operator will be for addition. Type double addition operator. And here will be for two numbers. Double for first addition number and double for second addition number. In the end of the line, add semicolon. Exactly the same logic will be used for another three operator. Highlighted line for subtraction operator, next highlighted line for multiplication operator, and last highlighted line for division operator. So everything exactly the same. There is first number, there is second number. The next line at void, calculator function, and semicolon. Next, integer main, add calculator function from this line 7 and return 0 semicolon. For addition operator, copy highlighted line, paste it and add return addition 1 plus addition 2. For subtraction, return will be subtraction first number minus subtraction second number. For multiplication, return will be first number multiplied on second number. And for division operator, first number will be divided on second number. In calculator function, add char operator, print statement, in which will be mentioned, please choose the operator. And each option for user to choose will be printed from new line. So A will be for addition, C will be for subtraction, M for multiplication, and D for division. Add scan f percent c and operator. User can enter only four options, which predecided in previous printf statement. If operator equal to a means user selected this option, then will be printed statement addition double for number one and number two. Print statement first number, where a user can type any number, and scan for first number. Next will be print statement for second number, and scanning for that second number. And last print statement will give the result. Now let's save it and run it. So far available only option for addition, so obviously I will type A and press enter. First number will be a random number, second number will be also random, enter. As you can see, everything is working perfect. For subtraction, logic will be the same that was used in addition. If operator is equal to letter S, which is for subtraction, then print statement will display subtraction. User will be asked to enter first number, second number, in this case, I will choose subtraction. First number will be, for example, 10. Second number will be 5. Enter. And accurate result displayed in terminal. Next, else if statement is for case when operator is chosen M for multiplication. User type first number, second number, and in the end, get the accurate result. This time I choose M for multiplication. Multiplication first number will be, for example, 5. Second number will be 10. Enter and accurate result. Last else if will be used when operator is equal to D, which stands for division. Same logic, user type first number, user type second number, and in the end, receive the accurate result. But in case user select wrong operator, then will be printed statement, please use valid operator. So let's run it last time and see the final result. This time I choose division operator. 
First my number will be, for example, 98, second number will be 8, enter, and this is the result. Thank you for watching my tutorial. If you find it useful, please consider subscribing, press like button, and if you have any comments, you can write it in comment section and I will reply it.